to help your gut avoid eating overnight, so reduce your eating time, do you eat late at night? Sometimes when I've come back from work late, I'll eat an hour before I go to bed, which I know is bad. And my heart rate monitor tells me it's bad as well because it calls me out on it in the morning. We all have busy work and sometimes you've got to eat and whatever. Mm. But if you just in the morning delayed your breakfast so that you had at least 12 hours between eating episodes and ideally 14, we're doing studies now that showing that's pretty good for most people. Giving your gut a rest is really yeah. important. So if you end up having a late dinner, then have a later breakfast. Correct. And that's what, if you ever go to Italy or Spain, you can't get an early dinner and you sit down to eat, but they don't have breakfast. They would have an espresso and a cigarette. And yeah. I'm not saying I'll have the cigarette. But <laughs> the, uh, you know what I mean? So yeah, it, yeah, it's yeah. not a big deal. They, they don't sort of say, oh, we can't go to work without it. Mm. And they would have something, a, a snack at 11 with their next coffee. Yeah, it sounds um, like I'm very much Italian. People just need to realise that if you focus on what your gut wants, then you can't go that far wrong. So I think yeah. that's really 